I think it means a lot, you know, not just to me, but I think the men in the room. You know, there's nine guys in the room that come in there every day and they work well together. I'm talking about the student athletes. And, and it hasn't been just one or two days or one or two weeks. It's been throughout the entire season and, and even pr really going back before that uh, where they formed a good bond. They work well together. They care about each other. They work um, extremely hard together. And so just to see that and the culmination of that, one guy's gotten the recognition, but I think, you know, he'll be the first to tell you that it's not just him. It's it's Caleb pushing him every day. It's it's Jackson with the snaps. It's uh, it's Colton with the holes. It's you know the whole group collectively. Did you see this in Keith? Uh, I think I think we've all seen it in Keith and in Caleb both. You know right. I think we've all seen that. It's just a matter that Keith has gotten the opportunity. But when did you first think that Keith could be an All-American? Uh, you know, All-American. That's for someone else to decide. Right. I mean, we don't look at it like that. We look at okay, can he go out and make kicks? Is he competitive? And I think we've seen that from him from day one, really. Um, you know, and then you know uh, Miguel came in and, and basically beat him out. But to Keith's credit, you know, he took his lumps early on, but he fought back and keep kept working and kept pushing. And you know, he didn't back down from any of that. And then you know, he's gotten the opportunity and he's made good with it. What did it tell you about him when he took he took Jackson and, and Colton uh, it, Atlanta with him? I don't think anybody else did that, right? It, it meant a lot to me. Um, yeah, you know, uh, getting emotional thinking about talking about it, but it's it meant a lot to me. It says a lot about Keith Duncan, the uh, first and foremost, that he would even think about thinking about others. But it's the first thing he said is, "I want to bring the snapper. I want to bring my holder, and my parents are going to figure it out, and we'll we'll make it happen." But that says a lot. I think it meant a lot to them. And I told those three guys down in Atlanta, one of my great joys as a player, as a coach, was just watching them be kids and be kids in Atlanta and having fun and just you know just enjoying the moment and the culmination of the season. So it's pretty cool.